What's going on guys? Bobby with Consumer Time Capsule back with another review for you here and today we're at the capsule to celebrate Mickey Mouse's 90th birthday with Oreo birthday cake flavored cream and so these are the newest type of Oreo cookies. There's three limited edition Mickey designs inside. Uh, why they would call them limited edition designs is kind of ridiculous. I didn't come up with that. I was reading that off the back of the package. Um, so let's see what they look like. Uh, if, if you're looking at this package and you think it looks kind of similar to the Pepperidge Farm Goldfish that's also celebrating Mickey's 90th birthday right now, I... Uh, yeah, you're definitely not alone in that thought process, because that's the first thing I was thinking. But at least they dusted off a, a flavor that they haven't tackled in a minute. Of course, Oreo celebrated their 100th birthday, which is a real accomplishment, unlike this 90-year stuff. Mm -hmm. uh, they celebrated their 100th birthday in 2012 with first a chocolate cookie with uh, birthday cake flavored cream and then a golden cookie with birthday cake flavored cream uh, oreo creation that year to uh, commemorate that 100th birthday so now mickey gets the same treatment and oh boy these really do smell like really like uh like birthday cake frosting mm. And that's what they look like. You can really see a confetti color scheme inside. You have the normal white cream base with um, bright red and blue colors, some yellow, some green, some purple. I can smell them from here. Oh yeah, they're very, very, very strong in scent. And let me try to get each of the designs going for you here. All right. So we start out with a very basic design. Ryan, let me know if you can see this. That's a 90 on there. Yep. And then we've got, I don't know if this is a party hat, but it looks more like a like one of those party sound devices. What do you call those, like a little blower deal? <laughs> uh. Megaphone? Party, yeah, like a like a little baby baby megaphone, and then one with Mickey, with a little party hat on. For his own birthday. Okay. And inside, you've got the kind of rainbow, rainbow speckled confetti cream. Let's see what these taste like right out of the box. Ryan, I'm giving you the megaphone. Ooh. And I will have the Mickey with the hat. It's pretty cute. Pretty good, and it's adding some textural elements. Like the confetti does have a little bit of, of texture to it. You know, the cream itself, though, is really similar to a regular Oreo cream. Are you noticing many differences between regular Oreos and the Mickey Oreos, Ryan? Um, well, I've never had the birthday cake Oreo. You never had the birthday never. cake? I don't think I did either. This does not taste like fake frosting. It almost has a texture of real frosting, does it? It has a texture of real frosting. It really smells like fake frosting. Yes, I does. was expecting it, it to taste like a Duncan Hines container of frosting out of the microwave with an Oreo cookie dunked in it, and it's not. Very similar to the taste of a regular Oreo with, um, with a little bit of added texture. And I'm gonna let you take some milk to it, Ryan. And we're gonna we're gonna see uh, see if that makes any kind of difference, but um, yeah, I don't know. I feel like this would actually maybe do better with the golden Oreo. I feel like the chocolate Oreo cookie overtook the frosting a little bit too much and a little bit more than you would see from those peripheral Oreo flavors. So we're gonna add some milk to it. And what did you think when you added milk to the uh, to the cookie? 
Did you think it improved things, uh, made a difference at all? What's what's the deal? I, I'd like to hear what you have to say on it. Okay. I'm going to say it. Uh, I think it's indistinguishable from a regular Oreo and milk. Uh, I taste almost no difference whatsoever. Are you getting any I, difference? I feel like the cream is more frosting texture, and I feel like it dampened the, the chocolate taste down a little bit. It did. Okay, so that's one element that I did leave out that you're really picking up on is the criticism that I just made of it, be, the court cookie being too chocolatey for the inside, that's quelled when, you, when, you're, when you're dunking it in the milk, for sure, for sure, for sure. Balances that ratio to one to one like it should be. But what I will say is that it's not a very differentiated product from the regular Oreo cookie. I just don't see a lot of unique characteristics to this version of Oreo. I mean, you get the Mickey design, certainly. You get the Mickey outside. You know, if you got a kid at home and loves Mickey Mouse, you know, it's probably going to be their favorite cookie, but um, it just tastes like a regular Oreo to me. Uh, in terms of the gimmick, look, they've done the birthday cake thing before, and I'm not a huge Mickey Mouse fan, and this package isn't changing that. It's <laughs> <laughs> kind of cool package. Uh, it's okay. I like white. White's Look, the white pops when it's around a bunch of Oreo cookies, but not when it's like on its own end cap or something. You know, it's like, it's a white, it's a white package. And um, I don't know. I think it's cool that they put the Mickey designs on the cookies. I think that that's something that they could kind of integrate into more different Oreo flavors as things go on. But really, this is not, this is not a, you know... The long line of, you know, like the cherry cola kind of, you know, Oreos that you have to go out of your way right now to go find. This is, uh, this is like a 4.5 out of 10 gimmick grade. Um, not, not anything that's super impressive, but it did inspire the need to make a review. So it deserves a little bit of credit. In terms of the taste... It's obviously very good because it tastes like an Oreo. Out of the box or out of the bag or out of the container or whatever, it's less, it's less good than an Oreo. <laughs> but then when you get it in the milk, it's as good. It's as good as an Oreo cookie, a regular Oreo cookie. So I'm gonna give it a I'll give it a seven out of ten. Really solid. I. Uh, if you're, if you're pairing it with milk, you could definitely go through a full package of these. If you're not, it might be a little bit rough of a battle. Out of the package, it's probably closer to like, probably a four and a half or five out of 10. But with some milk, I mean, it's up there. You know, it's, it's, as, good as, it's as good as any Oreo, regular Oreo that you'll have. So uh, I'll give it a seven out of 10. But uh, really guys, uh, Mickey, I hope you enjoyed your birthday celebration. We're going to at least make you wait 10 years for your 100th birthday. We're not doing this 91st birthday BS. Really, 90 is a bit of a stretch. So, uh, sorry, Mickey. We'll see you in 10 years. And for the rest of you guys, I will miss you until I see you. We got a shot of the package on the way out. Let's do it. There it is. Oh.